Mind holding my hand while I do something stupid? Remember that data pad we got from Carteri about a million years ago? I cracked it. I got a holo frequency from Isaac, Mr. Project 32 himself. I can't do this without you. Let's see this guy. Want to take bets on whether he's 10 meters tall and breathes fire? <laughs> right, quit stalling, Nico. What's this? Okay, before we get started, let's set something straight. My name is Mako. M-A-K-O. Got it? Call me Coral, and so help me, I will find a way to punch you through the holonet. Mako? And that's a name I never thought I'd hear again. We want answers. Start talking. Believe me, I would love to talk to Mako. I got plenty of questions myself. Unfortunately for both of us, I don't have much time for conversation at the moment. Think it might be in your best interest to talk sooner rather than later? Normally, I'd agree with you on that. My team has pinpointed Coral's location. Finding her is my priority. Nico, a word of warning. This isn't the life you want. Whatever happens, stay away from Coral. Why? What do you want with her? What did she do? She's killed most of the people involved in Project 32. I can only assume she'll try to kill you too. She's gotten almost everyone else. She's killed a lot of SIS. Seems to me you need to hire some outside assistance. This operation fails, Hunter. I might just give you a call. Mako, I'll contact you if my team's taking Coral into custody. We have a lot to talk about. Isaac, out. I'm intercepting all his outgoing transmissions. Looks like, yes, I have the coordinates he's sending out. Gotta be where she's hiding. That's exactly what I was thinking. I've downloaded the coordinates to the NAV computer. Let's go pay my sister a friendly visit.